Hello everyone, my name is Susie and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today, we will be on day 61 and I am so happy to be able to fulfill my vow to the Lord because doing so, I truly see the goodness of his hands in my life. I truly see the magnificent works of his hands in the life of the ones I love, the ones I am connected with, and the ones I pray for. And this is the beauty of hoping for what we do not have, yet we look forward to the goodness of the Spirit of the Lord. And so today, as we continue our day 61, we will continue as well Psalms 119 and we will continue on Psalms 119 verse 89 through verse 176. I hope you guys have the Word of God with you. And read with me. Psalms 119 verse 89. And before we go to the Lord in through His Word, may we read, may we go to the Lord in prayer. Heavenly Father, thank you so very much, Lord, once again, for allowing us to humble ourselves, our hearts, our minds, our strength to you, dear God. Because your word, O oh Lord, is eternal. And this is our ticket going to the heavens. This is our way of um, changing as well because your word changes us. We thank you, Lord. We give you honor and praise in Jesus' name. Amen. Your word, O oh Lord, is eternal. It stands firm in the heavens. Your faithfulness continues through all generations. You establish the earth and it endures. Your laws endures to this day, endure to this day, for all things serve you. If your law had not been my delight, I would have perished in my affliction. I will never forget your precepts, for by them you preserved my life. Save me, for I am yours. I have sought out your precepts. The wicked are waiting to destroy me, but I will ponder your statutes. To all perfection I see a limit, but your commands are boundless. Oh, how I love your law! I meditate on it day all day long. Your commands make me wiser than my enemies for they are ever with me. I have more insight than all my teachers, for I meditate on your statutes. I have more understanding than the elders, for I obey your precepts. I have kept my feet from every evil path, so that I might obey your word. I have not departed from your laws, for you yourself have taught me taught me for you yourself have taught me how sweet are your words to my taste sweeter than honey to my mouth i gain understanding from your precepts therefore i hate every wrong path your word is a lamp unto my feet and a light unto for my path I have taken an oath and confirmed it that I will follow your righteous laws. I have suffered much. Preserve my life, O Lord, according to your word. Accept, O Lord, the willing praise of my mouth and teach me your laws. Though I constantly take my life in my hands, I will not forget your law. The wicked have set a snare for me that I have I have not strayed from your precepts. Your statutes are my heritage forever. They are the joy of my heart. 
My heart is set on keeping your decrees to the very end. S verse 113. I hate double-minded men, but I love your law. You are my refuge and my shield. I have put my hope in your word. Away from me, you evildoers, that I may keep the commands of my God. Sustain me according to your promise, and I will live. Do not, put, do not let my hopes be dashed. Uphold me, and I will be delivered. I will always have regard for your decrees. You reject all who astray from your decrees. For their deceitfulness is in vain. All the wickedness of the earth you discard like dross. Therefore, I love your statutes. My flesh trembles in fear of you. I stand in awe of your laws. I have done what is righteous and just. Do not leave me to my oppressors. Ensure your servants' well-being. Let not arrogant oppress me. My eyes fail looking for your salvation, looking for your righteous response. Deal with your servant according to your love and teach me your decrees. I am your servant. Give me discernment that I may understand your statutes. It is time for you to act, O Lord. Your law is being broken because I love your commands more than gold, more than pure gold. And because I consider all your precepts right, I hate every wrong path. Your statutes are wonderful, therefore I obey them. The unfolding of your words gives, gives light. It gives understanding to the simple. I open my mouth and pant, longing for your commands. Turn to me and have mercy on me, as you always do to those who love your name. Direct my footsteps according to your word. Let no sin rule over me. Redeem me from the oppression of man, that I may obey your precepts. Make your face shine upon your servant, and teach me your decrees. Streams of tears flow for my eyes, for your law is not obeyed. Righteous are you, are you O Lord, and your laws are right. The, the statutes you have laid down are righteous. They are fully trustworthy. My zeal wears me out, for my enemies ignore your words. Your promises have been thoroughly tested, and your servant loves them. Though I am lowly and despised, I do not forget your precepts. Your righteousness is everlasting, and your law is true. Trouble and distress have come upon me, but your commands are my delight. Your statutes are forever right. Give me understanding that I may live. I, I call with all my heart. Answer me, O Lord, and I will obey your decrees. I call out to you, save me, and I will keep your statutes. I rise before dawn and cry for help. I have put my lips in your word. My eyes stay open to the watches of the night that I may meditate on your promises. Hear my voice in accordance with your love. Preserve my life, O Lord, according to your laws. Those who devise wicked schemes are near, but they are far from your law. Yet you are near, O Lord, and all your commands are true. Long ago I learned from your statutes that you established them to last forever. Look upon my suffering and deliver me, for I have forgotten your law. Defend my cause and redeem me. Preserve my life according to your promise. Salvation is far from the wicked, for they do not seek out your decrees. Your compassion is great, O Lord. Preserve my life according to your laws. Many are the foes who persecute me. But I have not turned from your statutes. I look on the faithless with loathing, for they do not obey your word. See how I love your precepts. Preserve my life according to your love. O Lord, 
All your words are true. All your righteous laws are eternal. Rulers persecute me without cause, but my heart trembles in at your word. I rejoice in your promise like one who finds great spoil. I hate and abhor falsehood, but I love your law. Seven times I pray, seven times a day I praise you for, for your righteous laws. Great peace have they who have, who love your law, and nothing can make them stumble. I wait for your salvation, O Lord, and I follow your commands. I obey your statutes, for I love them greatly. I obey your precepts and your statutes, for all my ways are known to you. May my cry come before you, O Lord. Give me understanding according to your word. May my supplication come before you. Deliver me according to your promise. May my lips overflow with praise. May you teach me your decrees. May my tongue sing of your word. Oh, for all your commands are righteous. May your hand be ready to help me, for I have chosen your precepts. I long for your salvation, O Lord, and your law is my delight. Let me live that I may praise you, and may your law sustain me. Last verse, 176. I have strayed like a lost sheep. Seek your servant, for I have not forgotten your commands. Thank you, Lord, for these wonderful verses that your law, your precepts, your commands, your statutes, Lord, are ever before me. Your word, O Lord, is a lamp unto my feet and a light unto my path. Your Lord refreshes me. May your word, Father God, shine upon your servant and teach me, O Lord, your decrees. Lord, Father God, thank you, Lord, for allowing me to read your word publicly. May someone, Lord, be saved today because your salvation, Father God, is enough. Thank you, Lord, for your wonderful love. Thank you, Lord. In Jesus' name, amen. Thank you so much, guys, for tuning in. And may you continue to dwell in the word of the Lord. Till we meet again, till next episode. And thank you for tuning in to my YouTube channel. Bye-bye for now.